Got another thousand dollars for you coming. Uh, about seven minutes from now, closer to five thirty. You can go fund yourself five thirty, and then six thirty be the last one uh, pre-game. Cavs pre-game starts tonight at six thirty here on MMS. It is the season opener. They are in Orlando at the Amway Center to play the Magic. That is a seven o'clock start here on MMS, and then off tomorrow night, and then off Friday night, and then Saturday they come home. I make right. a bold prediction. I think tonight the Cavs are going to win at least one quarter. Market. Yeah. Not the game, but one they'll score, quarter. They'll score more points than the Orlando Magic in at least one quarter. In one quarter. Mm-hmm. All right. You heard Bill Squire say it here first. And there's still a pretty good chance that I'll be wrong. All right. Well, your prognostications have not fallen on deaf ears. Mm-hmm. So Saturday, let's think about the. Mouth. <laughs> let's think about <laughs> the home opener, all right? Pacers are going to be in town. Yeah. But Reggie Miller, I'd like to give him what for. He's not the player oh, anymore. Oh, I'd like to really give him a piece of my mind. If you could hear him do. He's a by, rascal. He'll do a color commentary with TNT. And if you hear him do that, you might actually want to punch him in the face. Okay. I understand what you're saying. Uh, d- uh, those Pacers. Mm hmm. Danny Granger, why no, I ought to. No, Paul George, all right? No, he's on the Clippers. Mark Jackson, why I ought to. as well. I want to try it. Why I ought to. It's scary when she does it. Yeah. A lot of rage behind those Come eyes. Come over here, Jermaine O'Neal. I'm going to give you a little rap on the chin. Those frames don't hide all that anger. You <laughs> rascal. Yeah. Speaking of the Clippers, you see Kawhi Leonard get booed? Yeah. Whoa. And then uh, he's like, you know what? Boo me all you want. We're way better than the Lakers. Yeah, that's right. Why would they boo him? Like, Kawhi Leonard goes in the Raptors to, he goes, I'm going to go to the Clippers. The instead Lakers of the town. Lakers. The Lakers town. I know, but he's an amazing player. Like, why wouldn't Clippers fans be like, woo? Well, the you know? Clippers fans were cheering for him, but there's a bunch of Lakers fans there. Oh, I see what you mean. Because they it shared, was a, it's the same stadium. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see, I see. Yeah. yeah. It wasn't Clippers fans booing him. It was Lakers fans well, booing him. Well, but I thought some people were like, some Clippers fans, I got the vibe that like they were upset. I don't know. No, they're thrilled. Yeah, okay. They're going to, that's this what would have made sense they've to they've ever me. had to win a championship. Kawhi yeah. is incredibly good. That's why they need two separate Maybe. states. <laughs> they need to, you know, you can't yeah, share arenas. But it's still the same town, so you still have Lakers fans in town that are going to go <laughs> see know. them. So it doesn't matter if there's two stadiums. I know. But you're on your home court getting booed. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. He's trying to throw free throws out there. They'll put Kawhi Leonard at the free throw line. We welcome the audience from TNT. Wow. <laughs> That's yeah, intense. he's trying to address the crowd. And, you know. Hey, everybody. So happy to be out here now in the Toronto of the West Coast. He's- yeah, so anyway. He's a good player. And they got Paul George, and he didn't even play last night. And they still handled the Lakers pretty well. Mm. Anyway, I digressed. Saturday night, Pacers are going to be in town with Paul George. And uh, the uh, Cavs will be playing an 8 o'clock game. And so two hours prior, we will be uh, up the street at the Clevelander for the Alan Cox Show Just the Tip Off pre-party with Budweiser. And we're going to have five pair of tickets for Saturday night's game that you will win. We'll put them into your grubby little mitts Mm -hmm. if you can win the Pound Cake Hoop Head Contest. So we'll have five winners. Five winners? Yeah, so the top five scorers of Pound Cake's Hoop Head Challenge. It's a lot of people. Damn, how many balloons am I going to get hit with? Jeez. Probably about a 1,000. Is that okay? (laughs) That's probably a conservative estimate. Mm -hmm. 1,000 balloons. Fine. Hey, I'm making work for myself. I gotta blow these goddamn things up. Why you think I'm most, happy about it? Why can't no, promotions a, do it? They got other things to do. I assume yeah. I'm gonna be doing it. Now promotions is doing it. Hell, they are. How can you do a thousand balloons? There's there's a there's a balloon thing that you can get where you attach it to a hose and then you will it fills a bunch oh, yeah, up yeah, at the yeah. same time and then you just kinda like shake it and they like break off and tie up at the same I've time. I've seen that thing. It's but, really cool. Okay, but but uh, So we'll use that to fill them up and then we'll do a few with like the bonus one with a shaving cream. All right. All right. Well, that's Saturday. We'll be at the Cleveland. What's the weather going to be like? Is he going to get It's supposed to be nice. No, no, no. I think it's supposed to be nice. Am I going to be inside? Because I asked about that. No, we're going to be on the patio. They have a, For that like part. Out front? Yeah. It's going to be 59 degrees. You'll yeah, be that's fine. All right. That's good. It's going to be 54 by the time. 54 in rain. My it's going to be fine. Be hard. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Yeah, yeah we're all going to be wet. Yeah. I mean, we'll have umbrellas. Mm-hmm. 
You'll be you'll you'll get uh, the flu. Big and you'll deal. have the poncho on. <laughs> it's only your head's the only thing that's gonna get wet. Forget uh, don't forget my goggles. Oh, the goggles, yeah. Maybe you don't forget your goggles. I'm, I, I have to bring you goggles? Fine, but get my own goggles. Yes. You don't have swim goggles or tan goggles or anything? No, or? I have no goggles. All right. God damn it. <laughs> we'll go get some. They're like three bucks. Walk into an Aqua Tots. Grab a pair off the wall. Um. Yeah, so uh, that'll be Saturday. And besides, this is the perfect time for you to get the flu pound cake when you don't have anyone to take care of you. Mm. Clearly, I didn't have anybody take care of me before. That's why I broke up. Hmm. It's fine. It's wow. fine. Did your boyfriend take you for granted? Is that what you felt? Do you think that he took you for granted? Probably. Like most people. Well, that's a yes or no like question. Like most I mean. people. Yep. Like most people. I mean, I know I do. I know. It's fine. Because I'm used to it. I'll get my own goddamn goggles. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. It's so salty. I'll get my own goddamn goggles. Alan, that's the first time I've ever heard Pound Cake complain about balls. They're not balls. They're balloons, they're balloons you smart ass. <laughs> You smart Alec, and he complains a lot. So <laughs> definitely has complained about balls before. Because we when we do like the kickball thing mm -hmm. or whatever, not, not mm, kickball, something uh, the foot golf thing. Foot he complain about that, and that's got balls. And the only time yeah. I complain about butts is when I'm the butt of everyone's joke. So I get it. Hmm. Are you sure? Just like when I'm playing with, when I'm going to like. The foot golf tournament, or if I have to slide down a hill or whatever, I know I'm always the worst one. I always come in last place. Uh huh. Guys, it's fine. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I'm always in last place. Hey, you were. Listen, you and I. The only one year I won Polar Blast, you and I were in a dead heat. But it's every single time. I'm never in. I'm not even gonna get into it because I'm just gonna get worked up and I'm just gonna stop myself. <laughs> no, you haven't won yet. You know, every time listen, that I've been close you to winning, know it's how many. Been a, don't cry to me, white man. You know how many <laughs> years I didn't win my own goddamn but promotion until I finally you won. You didn't do a sudden death. Until it doesn't matter. I, a win is a win. But you didn't do a sudden death. You didn't oh, have to go down so, again. So you feel worse because you lost yes. in a sudden death? Why? I would, I would rather lose by a large margin. Than Isn't that how I lost last year to you, Bill? Didn't you and I have to do a thing no, over No, it again? was always me. I oh. always no, we've come done, close. I've done sudden death with Alan a couple times. Yeah. yeah. And he beats me. Yeah. I'm not out there whining about it. I'm drinking. <laughs> Having a good time. Being a good sport. Man. Yeah. Do you play the same game every time or... What game? I mean, what, whatever you're talking about, you're competing against. Our Polar Blast battle. Polar Blast we battle. Go to, so we do a tubing event. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. It's a good time. And, you know, since because of my condition, a.k.a. black, I don't like the cold. So every time I go there, I'm like... A.k.a. black. He calls it a condition. <laughs> oh, do we all like being wow, cold? Wow, I'll tell you what. I'm just saying, I never... He's like full-on Black Panther today, and I'm not sure where <laughs> that's coming what? from. He's really... Ha I'm black! We're like, yeah, we got it. I understand you're half black, by the way. I'm sure your dad would be very happy about that. I don't care. Oh, speaking of, uh, not your dad, but your mom, uh, how, did, uh, <laughs> how did Panera go? And then uh, how did dinner go? Oh, God, he sends us a photo last <laughs> yeah, night. Yeah, yeah, but... the, 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 okay, go ahead. So, What's the photo you sent us? The photo, okay. Long story short, because Gab, you weren't here for this. Okay. My mom is extremely picky when it comes to like eating at restaurants, but not when it comes to having an at-home meal. Okay. So her birthday is tomorrow. I said I was going to take her out for dinner because this is, uh, yesterday was her only night off. So I was like, Mom, where would you like to go? I was like, you can pick anywhere in the world. Like, I'm a splurk for you. I got money in the bank. Let's go. She said, I would like to go to Panera. I said, <laughs> no, what did she say first? She said Red Robin, but we always go to Red Robin. <laughs> Zero point. <laughs> Zero. So I was right. like, this year, Mom, we're not doing that. Like, we go every year. Let's pick somewhere new. Uh, you know, a white tablecloth restaurant. And she said, okay, awesome. Panera. Again with the white. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I really do like Panera, though. No, it's and good. And they're pretty but, pricey now, so really you would be splurging on her. Same thing Bill said. <laughs> yeah. and, and, then, and then she was like, well, if we can't go to Panera, scratch, scratch that. Like, we just won't go out at all. I just, I want to go and get my... Well, she gave up after Panera. Oh, no, she, well, she didn't give up after at Panera. It was when we went to Walmart. My mom likes to, an at-home meal, a good, like a TV dinner. Uh -huh. Instead of a TV dinner, she will get a Walmart chicken. Do you know the, what that is? The rotisserie, rotisserie chicken. chickens that they have. Yeah. Okay, in the bag thing? No. Like, it's like it, the it little, comes, like, tub, yeah. Like a plastic, plastic container. Yeah, yeah. So we go to Walmart to get her Walmart chicken because that's what she wants. She could eat off of it for days. It's we her go, favorite. I she get off work. Only from Walmart, though. Is it better at Walmart? 
to her. I it guess is. so. I guess it has the season. Every time yes, I like. try to do that, I can't finish one. I get grossed out after a while. <laughs> you would think. My mom loves them. <laughs> and she can eat that for days. That's her dinner. Good. That's actually a good source of. Uh, so you got her a chicken. End of story. Well, no, we go to Walmart, <laughs> and it's after I get off work, and apparently all their chickens are gone. <laughs> he sends us a picture in the group chat, and it's just the bare empty case chicken case no lights on <laughs> like the crew has gone home yeah, yeah it's complete. Yeah. and mom was like damn it damn it we got here too late and i'm like oh mom that sucks i guess i'm just gonna have to take you to a nice dinner now she's like no 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 she said no 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 that wait i'm like what She's like, I'm going to go ask the manager. I said, Mom, you're not going to do that. Yes. I'm like, you're she, not. I'm like, come clearly, on now. I was like, if it was, you have got one a more chicken, chicken in the back. Somewhere around here. Yeah, I was like. I was yeah, like, you didn't see one. It's still on the road. Exactly. I was like, if, if they had it out there, you think they wouldn't put it out? I was like, why are you going to go out and ask? Like, leave these people alone. They have enough to deal with. I love her. She, and she's like. The I, manager's got his own personal stash. He's like, all right, well, I don't usually let you <laughs> let the customers have these, but I have my own little side chickens that I do over here. So I was like, do you know how long it's going to take to find a manager? So she damn near like runs this guy over. It was just a guy like putting stuff on a shelf. Like she's like, sir. I'm like, oh, mom. And she's like, do you happen to know where the chickens are? He's like, actually, there's a uh, center, like I guess it's a center heater that they have like up by the registers that they have like stuff where you could get like on the go. Like it, maybe if you forgot something, you could just grab oh, something. Oh, so there's a second to- chicken location. There is. <laughs> And the guy, I and the guy, second chances. he knew it off the top of his head. He was like, "Yeah, if you go there." She's like, "Thank you." She, he didn't even finish what he was saying. They have impulse chicken. <laughs> they do, and that's where where the chicken was. Wow. So, so she goes. They've there. got gum, tabloids, mm. chicken. Yeah, impulse aisle bird. So she wow. grab, she grabs it. She's like, "Oh my god!" She's like, "I knew they had one." She's like, "And it's ripe too." She's like, "It's <laughs> it's ripe." <laughs> she said, "A she, ripe she chicken." She holds it up and she's looking at it like it's like a counterfeit dollar bill. She's like, "All right." <laughs> all right, perfect. And she so she got her chicken. <laughs> she got her chicken Did after you all. Get her the chicken, though? I got her the chicken. Okay, good. That's all. That was my only it's job. Six dollars. <laughs> yeah, that was my only job. I was like, so I was like, mom, there's an Applebee's right across the street. You want to just go? She's like, oh no, I'm going home and eating my chicken. Oh, oh. Pancakes. Mom was like the Duke brothers at the end of Trading Places. <laughs> <laughs> Our trade reopened right now. Uh huh. Turn those machines back on. <laughs> oh god. The, but the fact that she had to go ask a guy, I'm like, mom. It like, was the right thing to do because it ended up getting her the chicken that she wanted because of the impulse chicken. <laughs> <laughs> but just the, just my mom's utter reaction of, damn it, we're too late. I'm like, are you serious over some chicken that's in a deli that they'll have more with like tomorrow? But she had her head set on that. Her head and her heart yeah. were set. Her life. That impulse chicken. Oh, it's her birthday chicken. I feel like I have closure, though, that there was the backup chicken that were on the heat. Also, so wait, that means it's you also, don't get any dinner. I didn't get any dinner. I, and, she, and she was like, she was like, did you eat? She, I was like, no. She was like, well, there's a subway inside of this Walmart. You want to stop right here? I said, no, it's fine. I'll get some He's like, happy home. birthday <laughs> to you. So, so your mom, your celebration for your mom's birthday was walking around Walmart and then paying for her chicken. <laughs> yes. Did not eat. Oh, God. Did not eat till I got home. Did not eat. There's no, like, celebration together. You just- wanted to take her to dinner so that you could both eat. Yes. You ended up at Walmart. Yes. She gets a bird. You get no food. And I was like, I don't even know Panera, so I don't even mess with the menu like that, so I don't even know what I would have gotten, but... They have yeah. sandwiches. Um, they have plenty of good I know, food there. but like, she's just so difficult. Do you, do you know how insane that is? She's yes, like, we deal with you. <laughs> I got my, Where do you think on, you me, got it? Hold that thought. Let me get this money away. Right? I got that. buy a lot of impulse chicken. A thousand dollars here. Good luck. Hey, it's Rover. Go fund yourself. We have your shot at $1,000 now. Text the nationwide keyword WINGS to the number 200-200. You'll get a text confirming entry plus iHeartRadio info. Standard data and message rates apply in this nationwide contest. That's WINGS to 200-200. Good luck and go fund yourself from 100.7 WMMS. These words, man. Wings? Come how, on. how does... It's just like they listen I to don't, us. I, yeah, yeah. I, it's, I don't schedule them. It's random. It's funny, though. <laughs> Sometimes they really match up. They really do. Uh, text the word no dinner for pound cake to 200-200. Star. Rotisserie. <laughs> oh, man. It's funny. Yeah. Stupid chicken. So what did you end up eating? I got Subway on the way. <laughs> no, I didn't get the Subway inside the Walmart. Not the I was, Walmart Subway? I was you just so other mad. Subway? Yeah, on the way home, I was like, there's a Subway here. I was like, that is you not You didn't at least go idea. to Chick-fil-A or something? 
I yeah. mean, if you if you got to pick what you wanted, it, was, it wasn't on the way. Oh, I it see. It was just there was a subway down the road from You're my house. You're just looking for proximity. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but like I didn't want to go to that Walmart because I didn't want to compromise with her because I was like, you are just ridiculous. You hunted a man down <laughs> and, and stuck your finger in, her, in his face for no reason because you they ran out of chickens. You got there too late. But they didn't run out of chickens. They she just didn't he know where. He told her. Yeah, all he the chickens were located. Her. You know what they say? The squeaky wheel gets the backup chicken. <laughs> <laughs> it is also uh, instructive in that. Never assume that you've missed something. That's you right. go and you ask a person. You ask, See, yeah. me, I'm not that kind of person. If I go to the case, it's dark, it's empty, I go, oh, I missed it. You missed right? your chicken opportunity. I, I, I missed my chicken <laughs> opportunity. And, and perhaps there is something wrong with me. The fact that my mother does not want to spend her birthday with me. I was going to take her to dinner. She's like, no, that's fine. I'm going to She's go like, home, I'd rather just eat my chicken by myself. myself. Yeah. <laughs> lock myself in, in my house. In her defense, I do. I prefer eating a, a rotisserie chicken by myself because... Uh, like Gab said. Nobody looks good doing it. It's pretty gross. Yeah. It can get a little gross. Like, I, I just, there's a halfway point where I feel just totally barbaric. And I'm just like, <laughs> bones, and I'm just like, bah, and look like I'm a caveman. Yeah, that's why I said I walk into the house sometimes, and I'll see a dissected chicken just sitting For on the sure. counter. Yeah. I'm like, Mom, what are you doing? Man, get some deliberate chicken out there. <laughs> deliberate mm. chicken. Mmm. Now I went to go grab my son diapers today on my lunch break, and I copped one of them impulse chickens. <laughs> <laughs> it's damn good for four dollars and forty-seven cents. Is that That's all how it is? They are. This hey. person says four yeah, forty-seven. Like yeah. yeah, they're, they're really cheap. Five-dollar chickens. Mm-hmm. God, were mean, they full of I'd, hormones? Like I'd be ch- upset if I was that chicken. I'd full... be like, I'm only going for four dollars <laughs> yeah. and forty-seven cents. You, my, you ended my life for less than five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think about that. Oh. <laughs> God, uh, I am consistently surprised that there are hungry people in this country. Well, no wonder they when can't a full pay benefits at Walmart, a full <laughs> bird <laughs> more for a chicken. A full bird is five dollars. God, I mean they're not huge. Yeah, but it's still it's like a personal chicken. Well, you mean like a Cornish game hen? No, no, no. It's, I mean, it's, it's bigger, bigger than that. that. You can feed people. Yeah, you can off feed of that. a family off of it. But I'm or saying your mom. Like, <laughs> it doesn't look like it's not a turkey. It's not a. No, I understand. Thing. Yeah, it's like a rotisserie chicken. Yeah. Yeah. Bigger than four dollars and forty seven cents. I feel like that's gone down. They have plenty. <laughs> Clearly they're they're flying off the shelves. Because <laughs> by the time I got there it's at the only seven, way chickens fly. <laughs> at seven thirty seven I got there and there were no chickens left. So Did you offer oh. to put candles in it for her at least? <laughs> <laughs> she had, she wanted cool. nothing to do She's with it. She's like, me. My wish already came true. <laughs> <laughs> I got an impulse chicken. She yeah. Wanted nothing to do with me or my dinner or anything. And wow. she didn't have any sides or anything. She <laughs> no. just, just the eats chicken. the chicken. I'm sure she probably just has a fork and the bowl sitting in front of her, like, and just eats the chicken. I'm sure. Digging in. Yeah. Wow. Pulling the skin off and just dripping it down into her <laughs> mouth. Ew, that is barbaric. Don't, ugh. That's an ugly sight. <laughs> Your own personal <laughs> chicken. <laughs> personal <laughs> chicken. Uh, uh, uh. To avoid you on your birthday, <laughs> someone who cares. Man. Your own personal chicken. <laughs> I hate you guys. <laughs> Get it from the aisle over there. And if it's not there, uh, there's more. More chicken. <laughs> well, anyway. Happy birthday, Mom. Yeah, happy birthday, <laughs> Angela Bassett. Yeah. <laughs> I love me some that, That's after you eat it and it's too hot. You're like, ooh, burn my mouth. You're telling me the personal chicken guys shouldn't go into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame? Of course <laughs> they, they should. They, they should be in now. Man. They got my vote. I love the Pesh Mode. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, let me break. Uh, Gab Cruz is here. Boy, she's hanging out for dear life. She's doing a hell of a job. Um, the Sports Gab, if you want to find her on Twitter, for people who have asked. Reach out, touch wings. <laughs> and uh, we'll be back uh, after these. 35192 if you want to text. The Alan Cox Show on 100.7 WMMS. And everywhere you go on